Download the free practice worksheet on this topic or take a practice quiz at mathcation.com. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another awesome math video from Mathcation. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to add decimals and adding decimals. As you can see, we have three important things we need to remember when adding decimals together. The first thing we need to do is that you need to line up the decimal points in the numbers that are being added together. You will line them up vertically. For example, let's say we have 2.1 and 1.7. So these decimals here have to be lined up vertically. So that's what you're trying to do. After that step, you're going to add the numbers straight down just like you normally would from right to left. You add the decimals exactly the same as you would if they were whole numbers. Finally, you will place the decimal point in the answer directly under the original decimal point. So the decimal point in your answer will go directly under the original decimal points that have been lined up. And if you're learning anything right now, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on other helpful math videos. Alright, let's go ahead and jump down to our first practice problem. For this problem, we need to add the decimals together. And the two decimals we have are 1.2 plus 8.4. I'm going to go ahead and rewrite these so that the decimal points are lined up vertically. So we have 1.2 and we're adding that to 8.4. Now that the decimal points have been lined up, we can go ahead and add these together just like we normally would. So starting from the right, I'm going to say 2 plus 4 and that's going to be 6. And then 1 plus 8 and that's going to be 9. Now we have to place the decimal point in our answer, and the way we do that is we just move the decimal point directly down. So it moves, so it moves straight to the answer, and when you do that, you will get 9.6 as your answer for this problem. Moving on to our second practice problem, this problem gives us 3.5 plus 9.1. In order to add decimals, I'm going to rewrite these so that the decimal points are lined up like this. And I'm going to add from the right to the left. So I'm going to add 5 plus 1, and I'm going to get 6. And then 3 plus 9. Well, 3 plus 9 is 12. And then to finish our answer, we have to move the decimal point straight down. So I'm going to move it down into this spot right here, and our answer is going to be 12.6. Finally, we have our last practice problem for adding decimals. This problem gives us 7.08 plus 1.5. I'm going to go ahead and rewrite this so that the decimal points are lined up and we're adding. Now this time when you add, we have 8 plus and then there's nothing here. Anytime you are missing a number or you have an empty space like this, you're going to add the number 0 as a placeholder for that spot. So this would be like saying 8 plus 0 and that's going to be 8. And then moving on to our next one, 0 plus 5, that's going to be 5. And then 7 plus 1, that's going to be 8 as well. And then we have our decimal point here and here, so it's going to move straight down vertically. And our, and our final solution for this decimal addition problem is 8.58. And if you want to do some more practice on adding decimals, go ahead and click the link in the top right part of this video to be taken to some quick practice problems that will grade themselves and tell you how you did. Thank you so much for watching. Please like this video if you got something out of it and drop a comment telling me if this video helped you or if you need help with something else. See ya!